Hello everyone, welcome to The Grey Garden. It's described as a pseudo-RPG with a heavy story focus. And here's the story. The Grey Garden, a world where angels and demons live in harmony. Yosifier, a demon who likes flowers, enjoys a carefree life with her friends. Then, one day, a mysterious bat appears in the garden. This game is totally free. I'll have a link in the description to where you can play it for yourself. And here's my little warning. You might die of cuteness overload watching or playing this game because it is adorable. So there's my warning. Severe risk of adorableness overload. It might happen to you. Be careful. Okay, let's go. Once upon a time, there was a certain world. It had two groups who brought destruction onto each other. Why did they destroy? Why did they kill? The reason must have been lost to time. Though, no doubt the reason doesn't matter. Through long conflict and destruction, their battle continued as if eternally. At the end of the war, they made peace. They chose to coexist. Together, they would establish peace. Some may think it was folly. Some may think it was for the best. A long era of peace reigned. And so did pass a long, long, long period of time. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Hmm. What flowers will it be today? These ones are cute, too. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yosifier. Oh, late with the introduction, huh? I'm Yosifier. Just a demon full of energy. Oh, and I love to play in the garden. Oh my god, she's adorable. <laughs> oh my god. Adorableness overload. Reaching its peak. I don't know if I can take any more adorableness. Ah, good weather today. Hmm, <laughs> Do, do, do. Well, I guess I should get going. I... I don't even know what that is. Hup? Uh, hu yes, hup. Basic movement, mm-hmm. The garden. And here we go. I'm an absolutely adorable demon who can pick flowers. And from what I noticed when I just played the beginning to make sure this game actually worked, I think you can infinitely pick flowers. Got a flower. Got a flower. Got a flower. Give me all the flowers. They're too cute. I need them all. Give me this one. Look, this one's... This one's pinkish. This one's white. This one's orange and red. And yellow. All the flowers. Looks like there's stars in the pathway. Or something. Some very strange things on the pathway. It's like I'm walking on stars. Whoa. God, there's so many flowers. This garden is huge. 
Oh, it's a butterfly. A bunch of butterflies. Whoa. Flut <laughs> Flutterfly appeared. Wait a minute, do I have to fight it? It is described as a pseudo-RPG with a heavy story focus, so it does have some RPG elements. I... I don't want to fight it. Let's just escape. Safely escaped. Why would I want to fight them? They're... They're wonderful. They're so cute! So left of the garden, of course, I just came from there, and right to the beginning forest. Let's go to the beginning forest. Gotta love the music in this game. It just makes me feel so happy. Bright and cheerful. It's a bee. Look at the little bee. Actually, it's not little at all, it's actually friggin' huge. Pretty much as big as my head. Flutterflies. Hello, my friends. Although, since I can battle you, you're apparently not my friends. But I still think of you as my friends. Hello. Oh, hey, Froze. Oh. Here's Froze. She is kind of quick to anger, and can be sort of difficult. But she's a really nice angel, and my best friend ever. I thought you'd be here. I was looking for you, Yosef. Oh ho! I was gonna say Diablo. <laughs> almost misread the name as Diablo. A Diablo? Dialo? I don't know how to pronounce that exactly. Dialo baked apple pie and asked me to come get you. Oh, it's done already? Alright, let's go, go, go! Ugh. <laughs> I suppose it's ironic that the angel seems to be the not cheerful one, and it's the demon that's all happy. Hey, what is that? It looks like there's something wrapped in the tree. A long dead tree, something stuck in it. I just want to, I just want to like hum along to the music. It's so happy. Hmm. Divergence. Which way? What's down here? Nothing to do this way, probably. Oh. Never mind. No, out of my way. I don't want to battle you. Is that a hole in a hole in the sand? Uh <laughs> Yeah Ah Oh it hurts. Why is there even a hole here? I'm bleeding Froze Quiet, you blubbering klutz. I'll heal you up, alright? Just get out of there. I can't, though. I can't fly. I wonder if I made a little much. Oh my god, that thing is huge. Look at that. It's like the size of a pizza in diameter. True, Yosef is a big eater. It'll probably be fine. We're here! The pie's already done. Woohoo! We love your apple pies. D ah, I gotta figure out how to pronounce that name. Dialo? Dialo? 
Dialo. Dialo. I don't know. I'll pick one, maybe. What's with the wounds? Oh, um... She fell in a hole. Yeah, that. Froze had to patch me up. One wonders if your clumsiness could ever be cured. She'll die first. Nah, I'll get better about it. Probably. Ah, well. Dig in, everyone. Yay! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Look at her eyes. She can't wait to eat it. That is one incredibly loud clock I just noticed. It's Dilo. Or Dilo. Or something. She's really good at cooking. And, uh, kind of mysterious. She lives with Chellen. And Chellen. She's really quiet. Which is to say, I've never seen her talk. She lives with Dilo. You know, I think I'm gonna go with, I think I'm gonna go with Dialo. Dialo, like diabolical, Dialo. Hmm. Oh, I can actually move my character. Can I eat? Actually, hold on, before that. Can I mess around with this stuff? Apples for making apple pies, of course. An oven. Maybe this is how the apple pies are made. Eh, probably. <laughs> you might want an oven to bake an apple pie. Yosefire washed her hands. All clean. <laughs> Got a candy apple. I don't even know what that's for. Actually, can I... Would it be, be an items, right? Candy apple. One of... Dialo's candy apples. Cures status effects. Sweet. Literally sweet. It's a candy apple. Okay, let's eat. Eat the apple pie? Absolutely. Delish. Where do you even get such an appetite? Oh, it's nothing really. That wasn't a compliment. I don't even know what that is. Noa? <laughs> Noa? What? I think that's Chellen singing. So she doesn't talk, but she sings. Or hums, maybe. You seem to be a bit chubbier these days, Yosef. <gasps> no way! Well, now that you mention it. Yikes! I gotta exercise! But I'll still eat. Really. And thus, and so, this is a happy story of angels and demons living in harmony. Who are you talking to? Just forget about it. Talk to Froze. Hmm? What's up, Froze? Hmm? Well... It seems I've lost my pocket watch. Huh? Where? Hmm. It was already gone while we were eating the pie at, at Dialos, so... It should be near the forest? Hmm. 
Let's look together. Come on. Sorry. Wait, where'd she go? Oh, did she like merge into me? Yeah, okay. She merged into me. She's part of my party. Okay, need to find it. Map. So, village, buildings, castle, trees, garden on the left. Okay. Oh, I just want to visit all these places. Actually, can I save the game? Yes, I should probably do that. Okay, cool. Who are you? Apparently it's Demon. I'm ready to doze off any second. It's so warm. <laughs> well, enjoy your nap. Hello. It's an angel. She's humming. Oh, sweet. I can go into like, all of these buildings. I can. Hmm, should I talk to them first, or should I just go try to find the pocket watch? Let's try to find the pocket watch. The beginning forest garden, okay. So it should be around here. Ooh, up to go to the graves. Let's go left then. Okay. Where could it be? In the hole, maybe? A hole? Who even dug this? No kidding, it seems to be a rather perfect hole for sand. Or at least what appears to be sand. Very strange. What about down here? Nothing to do this way, probably. Hmm. <laughs> this music, I love it. Ooh. Hello, B. Oh, Mr. B. Bzzzt. Hmm? Bzzzt. Whoa, froze. Your watch is under Mr. B. Ah, so it is. Bzzzt. <laughs> Mr. B, could you just move away for a second? Bzzzt. Hmm, exterminate or try that again. I'm not gonna exterminate it, it's too cute. Let's try that again. Actually, is it gonna- I doubt it'd work, it wouldn't change anything, would it? It's probably gonna do the same thing, right? Yeah. Hmm. Do I have to? What items do I have? A ton of flowers, and a single candy apple. Hmm. Don't seem to have any magic. I have a cross sword. She has a box staff. Do I actually have to kill it? I don't want to kill it. Maybe there's something at the shop or something. I don't know, maybe I can put down like a a jar of honey to lure it away. I don't know. I probably just have to kill it. But I'm going to make a decent effort to not to. To, to not do that. Here's the shop. Here's the shop. Weapons and items. What are these things? Hello? Welcome! What'll it be? Spy. Oh. Well, that's not gonna work. Neither will any of that. Okay, well there's honey, but it looks like it just recovers. Something. MB, whatever that is. Oh, 
Okay, I'll go kill it. Okay, exterminate. We shall battle. Mr. B appeared. Hmm. I have no idea how this works. Let's just attack. And you attack too. Whoa, Froze just took 19 damage. That is not good. Do I have any magic? Nah, I don't have any magic. I think Froze should guard, actually. She's really hurt. Yeah, the bee's going for Froze. Guard again. Ooh. If Froze gets hurt again, gets hurt again, she's gonna go down. How much health does this thing have? Does it say? Okay, do you have any healing stuff? No. Guarding actually guarding is pointless. If she gets hit again, she's gonna die, so I might as well just attack and try to kill it. Okay, Mr. B was defeated. You win! 200 experience earned! 500 gold. Level 4. Yosefire Puncher learned. Froze Punch learned. Sweet. I've now learned the art of punching. Whew. He was a dangerous one, Mr. B. There. Your pocket watch. Glad we found it. Yes. Thanks. Don't mention it. It's the bat. And it's on fire for some reason. It's it's a fire bat. A few days later. And so we're here at Dialos to eat apple pie again. You're going to get so fat. Seriously. More like you will, Froze. I actually exercise regularly. I, uh, don't, but anyway. Hmm, that's not good. Hmm? What's it, Dilo? Taking your appetite into account, I'm a little short on apples. Say what? It'll have to be a very small apple pie having this few. What are you looking at me for? It's not like I'm going to be stealing your portion. <laughs> hmm. What to do? I'll get some from Apple Park. <laughs> oh my god. Look at her eyes. She looks insane. She looks absolutely insane. Will you? Yep. Let's go, Froze. Why do I have to come? It'll be some good exercise. I told you, I already do. Then I'm counting on you two. Just leave it to us. Time to go. Oh, another candy apple. Wait, can I just take infinite candy apples? 
No, okay, there's only two. Hey, Shellen. Just humming to herself. Please, bring the apples. Will do. What's in here? Hmm. Probably shouldn't open it. Aw, but I want to. A bed. Take a rest? Nah. Dyla's clothes are inside. Shellen's clothes are inside. Wait a minute, is there anything inside of the trash can? A trash can. It's empty. Aw. Alright, to the apple forest, or whatever it's called. Actually, let's talk to some of the local people. Hello. Whew. Uh, that's it. Nice chat. Okay. Good conversing with you. Can I steal your stuff now? It's locked. Damn. It's locked. Damn. Underwear and stuff. Damn. That's a strange place for a trash can. There's an abnormal amount of tissues. <laughs> I'm not sure if that means somebody's been crying a lot or something else. <laughs> Lined with Yosefire's favorite comics. Flowers Yosefire brought from the garden. Coffee with lots of milk and sugar. Flowers Joseph Fire brought from the garden placed in a vase. Filled with Joseph Fire's clothes. Alright, so this is my home, obviously. Don't open it. What do you mean, don't open it? It's yours. Joseph Fire's diary. Good weather today. Off to the garden. My latest worry is, what if I get hay fever? Okay, where have I been, where have I not been? What does this say? Oh, it actually tells you what this is. So yeah, I just went in here, right? Yeah, that's where I came from. Mm-hmm. There's a fire's house. Let's go through this methodically. Okay, so what is this? Not marked? Probably just random angels and demons? Eth... How do you pronounce that? Ethu and Kalb are always napping, you know? I know! Damn that Kalb! A bookshelf. Or so you thought. But it's merely a fake. Uh... Why would somebody have a fake bookshelf? This one's also fake. Gotta work out. Muscles. Flex. Muscle power. Okay, I'm gonna leave now. Let's play a game. Look at that up. Wait, what? Look that away? What? Hey? What? <laughs> what just happened? Okay. Look that a hay. Hay is for horses. What that a say? Say again? I think this were attempts at jokes, but they weren't funny. Twas empty. A kitchen counter. Hmm. A brush. Huh. That's fascinating. Tell me more about this brush you just found. I love pineapples. I also like, um, scissors. I think the people here are insane. Honey's delicious. I love to smear it on bread. But Munch? Is, are, is the demon actually saying, literally saying munch, or are they making a munch sound? Because you can't really make a munch sound with your mouth. It's not really possible. W without food. Or maybe they're eating. Right now. I don't I don't know. I'm hungry. 
I can't tell what's actually being said and what's supposed to be sound effects. If you find a cockroach, kill it. Kill it with fire. Will do. A bookshelf. A long series of books on the right way to like noodles. <laughs> okay. Clothes. Rows upon rows of books on how to eat ladybugs. Aw, why would you want to eat a ladybug? They're so cute. Empty. Okay, top row done. I've already talked to you, uh-huh. <laughs> okay, well, I don't think any of them are going to say anything to me particularly interesting. Lots of books on insects. Not too much interesting in these houses. There's the shop. I was just there. I guess I can afford stuff now. Maybe I should get stuff. Probably should. School is a pain. But it's not all bad, I guess. I like the box lunches. Good for you. Okay. I think I'm done exploring the houses. Let's go buy something. Weapons or items? Mm, let's go for weapons. Welcome. Okay, 500 gold. Let's see, what do I need? Some armor would be nice. Yeah, let's go with some armor. Let's go with two. Excellent. What else? Hmm. I want a hat. I probably need to equip that stuff. Yep, armor. There we go. That increased my defense by how much? Not sure. Oh, here we go. By five. From 16 to 21. Oh, let's also give her the helmet. Okay. And let's save. Wait, did I actually just save? No, I didn't. There we go. Okay. Need to go to the apple forest or whatever it was. What does this say? Gray Village. A wonderful town where demons and angels live in harmony. Was over here. Oh, I guess I'm going the right way. Lots and lots of apples. Apple Park. Apple Park. Everybody loves apples. Be careful not to overeat. Got an apple. Okay, how many do I need? Gotta be honest, I think I'm gonna be overeating. Seriously, how many apples do you need for this apple pie? Because this is getting kind of scary. Okay, what do I have at this point? Like, 20? Maybe I have enough? But I, even if I do have enough, I feel a compulsion to get all of them. I have 35 apples. I think that's enough. But I don't care. I'm gonna get all the apples. 
it's gonna be the biggest apple pie ever made. Oh my god, there's so many apples. Give me all the apples. Oh no. They come back? Oh no, I can't get all the apples. They're never gonna go away. There needs to be an OCD warning on this game. If you have OCD, you should not play this game, because you're gonna be trying to get all the apples forever. And they're never gonna go away. Okay. Gotta stop. Let's see what's over here. Even more apples. Oh, hey! I don't think they are. Wait, they are what? Oh, hey. Are wharf roaches tasty? I don't think they are. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think anything that has roach in the name is tasty. That's a pretty good general rule of thumb, you could say. Hello. I got the apples. That is a disgusting amount of apples. Right then, let's get back to Dialos. Wait, what, what is that? Hmm? <laughs> is something crying? Hey, is that? Is it coming from over here? Please, I don't want to gather any more caterpillars. Nuh-uh, we're going until the cage is full. No! <laughs> Macarona, Rawberry, what you up to? <laughs> These names are just so adorable. Macarona, Rawberry? I can't say them with a straight face. They're just, uh, they're so cute! Oh, Yosefire and Froze. Oh, we're catching caterpillars. Caterpillars? Y yes, caterpillars. Hey, Macarona. She's real timid. Face turns red just like that. But she's, she's a good grappler. Wait, what's a grappler? Someone who catches stuff, I guess? Rawberry. This girl loves to eat. Especially bugs and meat. So it's always weird stuff. But really? We have so many. Isn't this enough? It's already just too disgusting to bear. How? They taste so good. Yes, well, I don't eat bugs. Oh, you making caterpillar tempura again, or what? Hmm, I'm thinking jam this time. Wait a minute, caterpillar tempura? Isn't that where you, like, batter and deep fry stuff? Or maybe just deep fry, I don't know if you batter it. But deep fried caterpillars? Ew! Huh? To spread on what? Bread. Ugh. Ugh. That's repulsive. No, it's tasty. You'd know if you tried it. I, I'm quite fine, thanks. Uh, is it really that good? N Natch and Rally? What? Natch and ra What? Naturally? I 
she's saying yes. <laughs> I get that much, but... <clears throat> so, I think I'll need about 20 more caterpillars. Well, I'll help. Froze will, too. Why do I... Really? Thanks. We'll get 10, so you get the rest. Just tell me when you've got your 10. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Catch ten caterpillars. I can do that. That doesn't look hard at all. Come here. Oh, I need to battle them. Caterpillar appeared. I shall battle you. Hmm, do I attack caterpillar or do I attack caterpillar? I'm thinking caterpillar instead of caterpillar. Because caterpillar is a little bit too strong, but I think I can take caterpillar instead. Boom! Ooh, ow. You know what? I think it is auto. Let's see what the computer does. Good job, computer. Caterpillar obtained. Caterpillar obtained. Double caterpillar. Excellent. Ooh, leveled up. So we need six more. Ooh, Froze punched her foe in the gut. She used her punch ability. Four more. I'm not entirely sure why I have to fight the caterpillars. Can't I just pick them up? Super punch! Oops. I'm actually running a bit low on health. Ooh, nice dodge, Froze. Although I suppose it'd be kind of sad if you weren't able to dodge an attack from a caterpillar. You've got to be really slow if you can't. Yoza Fire. Learned. Hmm. White Prayer. Learned. Neat. Okay, should have ten. Ah, you caught ten. So have we... Wh what? She just stopped talking. Okay. Rawberry, we got ten. Yay, thanks. We got ours, too. Ugh. So much wriggling. Whoa. Dang. <laughs> That'll do. I'll take these home and have Sis help me smush them. Ugh. Thanks, everybody. Jam's gonna be great. Enjoy! Bye! Oh, she can fly? I wish I could fly. She... She left me behind? After she invited me? Ah, oh, that's nice. Wish I could fly too. Then why not fly? You have wings. No way. It's scary. Plus, if I can't fly, I can get you to carry me. Don't depend on me. Pfft, why not? Well, for now, we should go back to Dilo's since we got the apples. Okie doke.
Oh no. It seems the caterpillars have come out in force. Don't touch me. I don't want to fight you. I come in peace. And I'll dice you into pieces if you attack me. Hello. Oh, you're back. With a disgustingly large amount of apples, I see. We did our best. And well done. You're a bit late, though. Did something happen? We found Macarona and Rawberry and helped them collect caterpillars. Hmm. Would you invite them over? I can make quite a lot with all these apples. Oh, good point. I'll get them. They should both be home. Okay, where do they live? That's my house. Is it actually marked? That's the shop, obviously. It's just a sign. But, yeah. Froze his house. Maybe here? Oh, here we go. Hello. Oh, apple pie. Are you sure? <laughs> well, if you insist. There's one down. Now, what is this? A stuffed toy. Aw, she's got a stuffed heart on the ground. That's so cute. One of Macarona's spare hats. She has about 20 more. Her favorite storybooks. About grappling, mostly. I'm still not even quite sure what grappling is. Macarona's sandbags. Uh, what? Stuffed toys. Until recently, Macarona couldn't sleep without hugging one of these. Macarona will get mad if you open it. Okay, Rawberry. Ah, this is probably it, right? No, preserves sister's house. Oh, wait. Yeah, actually, that... Yeah, she said she was going to her sister's, right? Yes, who is it? Rawberry. Want to eat apple pie with us at Dilo's place? Oh, really? I'll go to that. Oh, and don't come inside. Yeah, I know. You're mashing up bugs or something. I'll bet. Maybe. All done. Let's go eat some apple pie. Ah, yes. Everyone's here. Hold on while I make the pie. Jelen, help me out. Hmm. Whew. Very forceful cooking style as usual, Dilo. You think so? Um, may I really? Certainly. Eat it all up. Thank you very much. Tasty. Sweet. Delicious. Mmm. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Man. Wouldn't want this to ever change. Indeed. Ah. Ah. It's just apple pie, people. You look happy, Froze. Well, nothing like that. Aw, Froze is all shy. Stop it. <laughs> it's gotten rather noisy, hasn't it, Jelen? By the way, can I have some worms to go with this? 
No, I don't have any of that. Whew, I'm stuffed. Super good meal. Can't eat any more. Neither can I. Could go for a worm dessert. Oh, well, that's troubling. Eh? There's still lots of pie. Eh? You did bring me an absurd amount of apples, so I went and made plenty of pie as well. Guess I did, huh? I told you only five. <laughs> she said five and I collected like 50. Whoops. Sorry. Oh my. Yes, it may be quickest to share this with others. Then what if we take it to... Blank black? What? Blank black? Does it say blank black? Blank black castle? Ah, oh, that sounds good. You can make the delivery. You betcha. Let's go, Froze. Me again. Work off those pa I keep telling you. You two are always so friendly. Well, yeah. Froze and I are friends sworn in love. Uh, I see. Think before you speak, moron. Aren't me and Macarona friends sworn in love, too? Yes, yes. Please deliver the apple pie, Yosefire. Roger, roger. <laughs> I do have the pie, right? Tons of apple pie. <laughs> okay, I believe the castle was up here, right? What are these things? Pillars of some sort or something. Hello, bees. are you? It's a huge robe thing you're wearing. Oh, it's about Ithu and Kalb. They're in the realm of black and white. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Ooh, where does this go? Pretty sure the castle is just straight up, so where is this going? Twisty. There's nothing here. Here we go. Blank Black Castle, or something like that. Blanche Black Castle? Strangely hard to say. Blank Black Castle. What a strange place. Really, I mean it. I really mean it. Uh, is it really? I didn't know that. I have no idea what they're talking about. Missing a little bit of context there. 
Okay, who do I share this with? Hello, do you want some pie? Do you want a massage? Sorry, I can't deliver that, but I can deliver pie. I tripped and nearly broke a horn earlier. Yeesh, that was close. Wonder if I should sketch the sky. D I don't know. Do you feel like it? This place is a bit maze-like. Lots of books. They're about memory. They're about sad stories. They're about old legends. Alright, so this is the white side. Not to be confused with any sort of segregation, of course. Oh dear god, where am I going? Where the heck am I going? Ooh. This looks right. Are those mini doors? It's locked. I think I found it. Oh, it's Ethw. And it's Kakalb. Good old Kakalb. It's been so long since I've seen you, Kakalb. Sky sure is pretty. It's your turn, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, are you ever bad at Othello. It's no fun when I just keep winning. Are you cheating somehow? Don't make excuses for how much you suck. What? It's just the truth. <sighs> it's not good to cheat, brother. Wrong, it's not me, it's... Brother. It worries me to see things revert to the way they were. Idiot, it's just Othello. Eh? Weren't you all pouty when I trounced you in cards earlier? I did not pout. Oh, I didn't read that. I just realized I didn't read that. Come on in. There. Hello. Good day. Hey, if there were. Hey, old man. Hey, what is with these people's names? Ethua, Kakalb, Wotus? You doing good? I'm great. I'm alright. Old man, excuse me. You don't come by often. What do you need? We brought apple pie. Apple pie? Dilo made altogether too much. Oh, really? Thanks. Isn't that great, Kakalb? You love sweet things, don't you? Not particularly. Oh, really? Yes, especially when I ate his pudding earlier. Don't talk about that. Hmm. 
And this person is Ethu. The god who made our world. Really nice. And also cute. And Mr. Kakalb. He's a devil. Uh, I guess. He gets mad when I call him old man. Lastly, Mr. Wotus. He's Mr. Kakalb's younger brother. Head angel, but always spacing out. Well then, I shall divide it up. Thanks. You kids should eat with us while you're here. No, we're all very full already. Aw, oh, that's too bad. Yeah, so we came here to work off those pounds, too. Very admirable. Not like Kakao, who just sits there all day. You're the last person I want to hear that from. Hmm? Don't mm me. Gosh, you guys are friendly. Almost like me and Froze. Huh? No, no. You're making me blush. Hey. Okay, so what do I do now? Just leave? Thank you. <laughs> Doesn't say anything. Of course. Nope, I massive amount of pie is gone, of course. Let's, I guess we go. Ah, now that's tasty. Hmm? Boy, you're so difficult. I know you love sweet things. Don't know what you're talking about. I thought you loved chocolate. No clue. Oh? But I've seen you sneaking chocolatey snacks while everyone's asleep. How did you know? Eesh, Kakalb. I'm God, you know. I should at least know that stuff. <laughs> as if you haven't been awfully idle as of late. Well, yeah, that's peace for you. Peace is something to be feared. It really dulls you. Hey, what's with that look? Something on your mind? I don't care. About what? I don't care if someone comes to attack. Oh boy. Are you, King of Demons, saying there's someone else? Uh, at any rate. There's more than just those from our world, you know? Ah, so they're otherworldly. Please, it's fine. My stones alone make a perfect defense. Well, but if they get destroyed... Who can say? Ahem. And some of them are rather decrepit. <clears throat> Yeesh, are you that scared? Can't sleep without a nightlight. Or without me, maybe. No, <sighs> idiot. Relax. No matter what happens, I'll protect you. I take offense to that. Why? Is it because I... Enough already. Oh god, do I actually have to find my way out?
Let's see if I can manage. Hmm. Oh, actually, I think I just found my way out. Yeah, I did. Okay, sweet. Hmm. So now what do I do? Go to sleep? Let's go talk to the rest of the group. Hello. See you. Wait, I already left. What are you talking about? Hmm. Maybe it's time to sleep? Let's take a rest. Fully recovered. Cool as it is, it doesn't actually help me. So, now what? Okay, pie's delivered. Uh-huh. So there's the garden, there's the apple forest, there's the castle. Have I gone down? I'm not sure if I've gone down. This isn't the way to blank black castle. Wait, but... Didn't I finish there? I did give away all the pie, right? Yeah, I don't have it anymore. Hmm. What did I miss? Let's go back and find out. You know what, actually, I feel like this is going to be a fairly long game. And I've already been recording it for more than an hour, so I'm actually going to end the episode here. And at the beginning of the next episode, I'll figure out... Or, before the beginning of the next episode, rather, I'll figure out where to go, and what I've missed. I'm really enjoying this so far. It's very simple, there's not much to it. So far, it's just basically fetch a bunch of stuff and talk to people. And that's perfectly fine, because it's a absolutely adorable little world. I just like the music and it's just... I don't know, it's really fun. Just to do silly things like fighting caterpillars and collecting apples for an apple pie. I like it. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far and I will be back soon.